Welcome to the SFL Weekly Update for week numero ocho, or week number eight. In this week's matchups, we had Nestor's the Night King beat Chad Michael Vincent by a score of 35 points. Hey, motherfucker! Fat dick in your mouth, bitch! Take a look around. It's pimp shit going down. It's a whole lot of bitches and a whole lot of freaks. Top nachos, they fucking nigga every week. Holy fucking shit! Gang. <laughs> <laughs> then, in the whooping of the week, Big Maurice in Big Things Poppin'. Laid down the smackdown on the top team in the league. Girly top and bell bottoms by a score of 217 to 156. That is a 61-point margin of victory and the whooping of the week. Caesars fuck off getting their second win finally against Julio's Bud Kilmer, which is the reigning champion. Not looking bueno for him. 152 to 111. <laughs> <laughs> then your people's champion, La Piper, was able to defeat the walking man of memes, the lord of the memes, the walking dildo, Nicholas. 191 to 171, 20 point margin of victory. I be on the miles of hen dog, and now y'all got problems with me. That, Let uh, me celebrate. That is something. And what was gonna look like an upset, but was not because Monday night, Demarius Thomas and Tyreek Hill couldn't pull it off. Adrian Suckalamink held off Boom Shanwe's. <laughs> Edgar's Boom Shanwe team, 127 to 116, 11 point margin of victory against the worst team in the league. My disappointment is immeasurable, and my day is ruined. The new standings are as follows. Gurley top and bell bottoms maintains his number one at 6-2. and two. The Night King now also 6-2 and two, keeps his second place. Adrian winning keeps third place and a 6-2 and two record. Then we have three 5-3 and three teams, which is the Jan Michael Vincent, which is Carlos' team at fourth, Maurice at fifth at Big Things Poppin', La Paipa at six, which is me, the people's champion. So as of right now, these six teams, these top six teams are the playoff teams. Since, you know, playoffs, it's week eight, week nine now. Week 13 is the last. So it's that last five game stretch where things matter. Um, and officially the first one off of playoffs would be Julio, Bud Gilmer team of three and five, who is now two games out of playoff contention then we have nicholas's lord of the memes which is the dildo he is three games out of uh playoff contention caesar's fuck off team is also three games out of playoff contention in ninth and <laughs> edgar's boom shanwe's team which is the possible dildo candidate for this year technically he wins five straight he can technically make it in but it's very hard. He's more than likely mathematically eliminated, pending what happens next week. Next week, he would be officially eliminated if he loses. So let's see who we play next week. So... This week's matchup, <clears throat> we have Nestor's Night King going up against Caesar's Fuck Off. Both of them looking to keep streaking with wins, with Nestor with a two week a two, a two win streak and Caesar's one win streak of two and six. Then we have the top team in the league looking to rebound against Julio's Bud Kilmer, who is sliding with losing three straight. Technically, Arthur. He's lost one straight, so he's, he's technically sliding, even though he's not. Technically. Then we got two teams on the rise, both with three-game win streaks. We got Juan's La Pipa going up against Big Maurice's Big Things popping everything big over there like Texas. And it's a battle to see who will solidate their playoff spot. I mean, they go one goes to six and three, the other goes to five and four. Either way. Matchup of the week. Then we got 
a battle of two slums. We got Suckle of Mink and Lord of the Memes going up against each other. I mean, Nicholas has lost three straight. Adrian should have lost to the worst team in the league, but got bailed out. So, shout out to Zach Miller. Then we got Edgar's Boom Shaman, which is the worst team in the league. Still no victory. Close, but no cigar. Against Carlos's the Jan Michael Vincent. And those are the matchups for this week. Stay frosty out there. Like and subscribe. Stay frosty. Happy Halloween, bro. Happy Halloween, y'all.